again, another Vermont Overland. I guess this is my ritual. I just go to a Nitro Bar before I leave. Also attached to Dash Bicycle, which is a, a bike shop right here in the bar, in the cafes right here. Bike shop, cafe, bike shop, cafe. Both great people. Got myself a breakfast wrap and of course a Nitro. Um, we are heading to Vermont for Vermont Overland, the Vermont Overland 2023. Camping out Friday, Saturday with John, Adam, and Jeremy. It's raining today. It's kind of been, uh, the weather's been a little back and forth, so it's looking like we might have some scattered showers tomorrow, but it's trending in the right direction, so we're gonna hope it stays that way. Got a uh, two hour, 52 minute drive. Gonna go ride and race some bikes. So yeah, stay tuned. Oh, well, would you look at this? Would you look at that? We're on our way to Vermont Overland. Me and Adam in Adam's truck, the big boy truck. We got all of our stuff in here, all of our camp gear. Adam's got a nice, what do you call it? The bed of the truck that's covered. Oh yeah, tonneau covered. What is it? Truck life, it's tonneau covered. Hashtag tonneau cover. And uh, we're meeting at Brownsville Butcher? Pantry? Pantry Butcher. Brown, Brownsville Butcher and Pantry. I get maybe a breakfast sandwich, getting there a little bit early. It's like 10.20 on Friday. We're going to set up camp, hopefully dodge some rain, get in a little bit of like an opener's ride if it all works out, and sleep, and then race is tomorrow at 10 a.m. in 23 hours and 38 minutes. We'll be rolling. Oh. Your truck is set two minutes faster. Yeah, dude. You're one of those guys? Yeah, I get places on time. Yeah, you're going to get in places <laughs> on time. And look, the sun's peeking out a little bit. Those are good. That's boating well for us. And yeah, we'll catch you at Brownsville Pantry. Probably not gonna get a donut today. I think I'll save the donut for Sunday. Donut review time? Yeah, yeah, but I don't need like a big donut today. I need a breakfast sandwich. That's yeah, I need. I need a breakfast sandwich too. So cut two breakfast sandwiches. There's Jeremy. We made it to Brownsville Pantry. Me and Brian pulled up at the exact same time. This is Brian. This is Brian. Say hi, Brian. Here we are again. Look at these boys. Yeah, you used to have more color, so. What up, boys? Like five hours. You get a donut? No. Dude, wow. Sunday. Sunday donut. Sunday donut. Sunday breakfast. Sunday brunch. Skeeto Road? Skeeto Road! Skeeto Road? Skeeto Road. Setting up base camp. This is the crib. There you go. Is that better? We got cozy. Pretty much took over here. Adam's tent is the size of like four cars. <laughs> Dude, it's bigger than your pickup truck. Unbelievable. Wait, this isn't my GoPro. I don't know whose this is. Whose fucking GoPro is this? Well, I somehow have Brian's GoPro, but we're on a little shakeout opener's ride. Pasta dinner. Chef. Bike mechanic. Yep. Average rider. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we got Chef Adam in the house. What He's you, just what? under Chef Boy RD. What I apprentice under him. Thomas, home, thanks. Home, this is my plate. Homemade hey, sauce, right? Good. Yeah, homemade. Homemade from Great you Value. Milled the, you milled oh. the tomatoes. It's getting really rowdy over here. <laughs> yeah, rowdy. Do you get the electrical tape out? Different ways of mounting numbers. How do you guys feel? Mine is superior. Wow. Okay. Adam's looks like trash. That's a candidate for Friday. Why does it? <laughs> why is yours superior? Because it looks better. Looks clean. better. Look at this. Can't even see the. Look at those zip ties. True. Runs in with the electrical tape. Nice. There. Don't one. even need it on the bottom. Wow. 
Saving weight. Adam, explain your method. Not a fucking sale like that thing is. Look at that. <laughs> Damn, you're right. How many watts do you think I'm losing? Probably like four or five. <laughs> I would think that's, re I mean, if leg hair is worth a few, this has got to be worth something. Jeremy's in here watching for you in Seinfeld. It's nice to have some All of a sudden stuff. it was like, dom, da dom, dom, dom. You see, when you're single, you are the dictator of your own life. I have complete power. When I give the order to fall asleep on the sofa with the TV on in the middle of the day, no one can overrule me. It's the morning. Shram is giving away free coffee and uh, yeah, free with the purchase of a wheel set. I'll be eating it anyways, I don't care. We are just about two hours to the start of Vermont Overland, and good morning to everyone here at Mount Scutney. like uh, everyone else is doing up this hill warm up complete heading to the start line a lot of people yeah no i mean like it's just the initial like i will give you a five six countdown <laughs> As you can see, I'm walking with my bike. Nasty flat in the back. Big old slash. Put a plug in it. To the work. Tons of people passing me. About 45 minutes in, I need a pump. Don't have a pump. Should have carried a fucking pump. Two miles to go. I'm snacked. Absolutely snacked.
while we finished, we washed our bikes and now it's gonna storm. Just in time. That was brutal. 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 It started pouring out right when we were gonna go get food. So we're letting that pass and we're all gonna have a beer. John's gonna have so many beers. Yeah, dude, I'm getting fucking loaded. <laughs> Girl dinner, girl dinner. <laughs> We're gonna go eat food. Food time. Hopefully someone found my GoPro. Thank you. Your raffle chicken. Wow, a beer and an ice cream. Amazing. If Jeremy doesn't have two in his hands when he leaves there, I'm gonna- That was the deal we made. I said you can his two, ass. Right? It is good. Why it? Why it? Why it? Why it? Woo! Hell yeah. Whoa. He's drunk. <laughs> Matt Brannage coming in right now. Put your hands together for Matt Brannage. at Vermont Overland 2022. So many people working so hard to make this race happen. I can't name them all, but they're all out here. We're gonna have a break on the fence. I love that. The, I love that. <laughs> it's really the best. <laughs> and that's a wrap. That's a wrap. Did everyone have a s'more? I did not. Sunday breakfast. Sunday brunch. Out for a little recovery spin. Seven stars would charge for like something that's a quarter the size of this. As I am driving away from beautiful Vermont, overlooking some mountains right now. But that's it, another overland in the books. Only the second one for us. This was the tenth overland. And what a great weekend. I mean, anytime I come out to Vermont. You know, I have family here. It's right down the street from where the race starts. So we do the race, went and stayed at my mom's house, went out to dinner last night, went for a little run this morning. It was just a great weekend. Every time I come up here, uh, I get a little sad to go home. But the race was amazing. Uh, it was put together very well, in my opinion, way more organized than last year. The course was relentless, muddy. Uh, the class four sections were crazy. Uh, the climbing just didn't end. Uh, my performance wasn't what I hoped for, but you know, we did the thing, we all finished. Um, we all killed it and just had an overall great weekend. Uh, shout out to Ansel Dickey, who is the promoter of Overland. Uh, somehow, Actually, you know, John lost his GoPro and miraculously someone found it and Ansel hand delivered it to me yesterday. So thank you for that. Um, I was 
second guessing it for next year um, but I don't know I think uh, I think it might be a yearly thing so we'll see doing my two hour 45 minute drive home and rambling to you and um, that's pretty much it so yeah hope you guys enjoy the video and uh, stay tuned for the next one Decaf left, regular right. Decaf left, regular right. It's very challenging work. 